In this one, we're looking at possible fossilized shells. Well, in my opinion, I think we might be looking at something else except the standard pebbles that the rovers have found in the past. We're back with the rover curiosity and photographs taken on Sol 3603. Yeah, we'll be looking at two photographs taken by the Mars and Lens Imager or Mali camera on Sol 3603. This photograph was acquired on the 25th of September 2022. Here's the original photograph. Check out these round spherical objects, folks. They seem to be stuck to the side of this boulder or rock. They're not like these standard pebbles that we see lying about on the surface. These are actually on the side of this rock or boulder and they seem to be in, attached. Maybe they were encrusted onto this rock. I'm not sure folks, but let's zoom in on those over there and check out the perfect rounded shape of these objects. This photograph was acquired on the same day, the 25th of September 2022. It looks like the rover brushed this area of here with its steel brush. And this is what makes me think these are not just pebbles, but actually shells that are embedded and attached to this boulder or rock. If you scrape away the area of here with the brush, surely if these were pebbles, they would have moved out towards the outside of this area. But it seems like they stayed right there. They were polished up as well when the brush scoured the surface. There it looks like the shell or outer layering of this object cracked and you can see a hole right there in its center. Let's take a closer look. Check this out folks. I'm sure you'll agree with me it looks like these spherical objects are actually embedded or attached to this rock or boulder. Let me know in the comments below if you think I'm onto something here, yeah, guys and girls. If you scrape this away or brush this away, surely these, if they were pebbles, would have moved away. These also remind me of another weird anomaly I featured a while ago. This was taken on Sol 3545 by the mast cam. And we'll be zooming in on the small donut shaped object to the bottom left. Check this out. Again, a perfectly shaped spherical object. These pebbles were photographed by the Rover Curiosity on Sol 2356. And you can see, this is what I was talking about folks, the pebbles are loose and they're lying on top of the surface. But this avia to the bottom left caught my eye. Check this out. It looks like another one of these shells that we get here on Earth. You know those, they're like donut shaped, like a round shell with the hole in the top. This is what these remind me of. I'd say these are approximately a centimeter in diameter. And then also a while ago I featured some strange anomalies spotted on Sol 3548 by the mast camera. And we'll be zooming in on those objects on the side of the cliff over there. 
Check this out. It looks like shells or fossilized shells attached to the side of this cliff face. Much like we'd find here on Earth on the seashore where there's rocks and boulders, these strange long narrow shells attached to the side of the boulders. So, are we looking at pebbles embedded into this rock? Or are we looking at possible fossilized shells? The evidence, in my opinion, points to we might be looking at fossilized shells. But that's my opinion, guys and girls. Let's have a chat in the comments. I'd love to hear what you think of my theory or hypothesis. As always, thank you for watching. I do appreciate each and every one of you. Your viewership and support means a lot to the channel. I appreciate all the comments as well. I try to reply to most of them when I have time. I've just been really busy with work lately, guys. So I haven't replied to all your comments to my last two videos. So I do apologize for that. Take care. I'll see you in the next one very soon. Cheers for now.